Hi friends, I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to BR Max class. In this class, we will learn the definition of modulus function and examples to understand the definition of modulus function. And we will learn domain, codomain, range of a modulus function. And we will learn how to draw the graph of modulus function. First, we will learn the definition of modulus function. A function f from set of all real numbers to real numbers is defined by the function is from where to where set of all real numbers to real numbers and it is defined like this you observe here the function is defined like this f of x is modulus of x we read it as modulus of x modulus of x will be x whenever x greater than or equal to 0 modulus of x is minus x when x is less than 0 we'll understand this more clearly when we do examples okay so first i am writing the definition what is the definition of modulus function the function is defined like this is called modulus function we'll try to understand how the function is defined with examples see here what they given modulus of x value is x when whenever this x is greater than or equal to 0 modulus of x value is minus x when when x value is less than 0 okay here i'll take modulus of 3 you observe here whatever the expression is there here this expression 3 3 is greater than 0 or less than 0 3 is greater than 0 so it comes to the first case so modulus of x will become what modulus of x will become x so as 3 is a positive number modulus of 3 is 3 only for example if i take modulus of 5 divided by 4 here you observe that whatever the expression 5 by 4 is there this 5 by 4 is greater than 0 or less than 0 5 is positive 4 is positive 5 by 4 clearly positive positive number means it is greater than 0 so 5 by 4 is greater than 0 it comes to which case it comes to the first case then modulus of x is what modulus of x can be written as x so what is modulus of 5 by 4 modulus of 5 by 4 is 5 by 4 modulus of 1 lakh you observe this 1 lakh is positive or negative 1 lakh is positive that means it comes under first case or second case it comes under first case so modulus of 1 lakh is what modulus of 1 lakh is 1 lakh only now modulus of 0 modulus of 0 you observe this expression 0 here in place of x 0 is there x equal to 0 you observe this first case when x is greater than or equal to 0 when x equal to 0 which function to choose first function or second function this first function modulus of x is x so modulus of 0 is what modulus of 0 is 0 only till here no confusion now you see here this uh, second one it is important modulus of minus 3 you please try to understand this minus 3 is less than 0 or greater than 0 minus 3 is less than 0 it is under second case that means x is less than 0 when x is less than 0 what is modulus of x modulus of x is minus x minus x here modulus of minus 3 is minus x that means what is there here same image you need to write here in place of x what is there minus 3 is there that means you need to write minus 3 please try to understand it is tricky one but very easy minus of minus is plus so this is 3 so what is modulus of minus 3 modulus of minus 3 is 3 so here modulus of minus 9 is there what is modulus of minus 9 you observe about this minus 9 minus 9 is negative correct yes minus 9 is less than 0 when x is less than 0 modulus of x is minus x minus x modulus of minus is what minus what is x in place of x here minus 9 is there minus of minus 9 is what plus 9 so what is modulus of minus 9 modulus of minus 9 is plus 9 consider that modulus function is a positive mission if you give positive number to modulus function it gives positive number only look here if you give negative number to the modulus function it makes it positive what is modulus of a minus 100 what is modulus of minus 100 it is plus 100 why because as per the definition when x is negative modulus of x is minus x so minus of minus 100 is 100 i hope you are understanding so these are the examples to understand modulus function now we will write what is domain codomain range of a modulus function domain 
what is domain of a modulus function we learn from the definition if f from a to b is a function then set a is called domain correct set a is called domain here this is a function from where to where set of all real numbers to real number so here you observe this one this is domain of modulus function so what is domain of modulus function domain of modulus function is all real numbers and what about codomain of modulus function codomain if f from a to b is a function then what is set b set b is called codomain set b is called codomain here you see this function is from where to where set of all real numbers to real numbers now what is codomain of this function codomain of this function is set of all real numbers now we will try to understand range of modulus function this is important range of modulus function what is range definition set of all images of domain set set of all images of domain set is called range of the function you see here modulus of 3 is what 3 that means image of 3 is 3 what is image of 5 by 4 image of 5 by 4 is 5 by 4 image of 1 lakh is 1 lakh image of 0 is 0 image of minus 3 is what image of minus 3 is plus 3 image of minus 9 is what image of minus 9 is plus 9 image of minus 100 is plus 100 image of minus 1 by 2 is what image of minus 1 by 2 is plus 1 by 2 what you understand here all images you observe all images are positive real numbers so 0 is possible or not you observe this modulus of 0 is what modulus of 0 is 0 so what is the range of this function range of this function is closed interval 0 to open interval infinity that means all positive real numbers including 0 okay so the range of modulus function is all positive real numbers including 0 now we will learn how to draw the graph of modulus function you observe here i considered a coordinate axis here i considered some x values when x is 0 that means modulus of 0 is what modulus of 0 is 0 modulus of 1 modulus of 1 is 1 modulus of 2 modulus of 2 is 2 modulus of 3 modulus of 3 is 3 what is modulus of minus 1 we know that modulus is a positive mission if we give negative number to it it makes it positive modulus of minus 1 is plus 1 modulus of minus 2 is plus 2 modulus of minus 3 is plus 3 now i'll plot all these points in this you see first point is 0 comma 0 where is the point 0 comma 0 you can observe this is the point 0 comma 0 now the point 1 comma 1 here is the point 1 comma 1 this is the point 1 comma 1 next point 2 comma 2 where is the point 2 comma 2 here you know how to plot the points on the graph paper okay now the point 3 comma 3 here here this is the point 3 comma 3 okay now next point is minus 1 comma 1 x is negative y is positive it lies in which quadrant it lies in second quadrant so this is the point minus 1 comma 1 okay this is point minus 1 comma 1 minus 2 comma 2 see you observe here this is the point minus 2 comma minus 2 comma 2 okay next minus 3 comma 3 where is the point minus 3 comma 3 you look here this is the point minus 3 comma 3 now you observe i'll join these uh, dots we will see what happens here you observe this uh, it is uh, like a straight line we got this like a straight line and you join this side also we'll see what you will get you observe here we got a v symbol modulus function is v symbol which graph it is this is the graph of uh, modulus function so what we learn in this class we learn the definition of modulus function and we learn what is its domain codomain range of a function and we learn about how to draw the graph of a modulus function and how the graph of modulus function looks it is very easy to remember the graph of modulus function graph of modulus function looks like a vector symbol v symbol right i hope you understand this class in next class we will learn the properties of modulus function <music>